So we're joined by Reggae Boys defender Joel Latibuder. Joel, firstly, how are you doing and how does it feel to be back in camp? Yeah, um, thank you for the for the welcome and um, yeah, I feel great to be here and uh, yeah, meeting the boys, meeting the new staff. Um, yeah, it's just great to, to finally get here and a relief to get everything sorted so I can uh, represent Jamaica. Yeah, of course. Remember last year you made your debut. What was that moment like when you were able to take the field and wear the black, green and gold? Yeah, it was a very proud moment for me and my family. Um, it is my dad's side that is Jamaican. And um, yeah, it was just nice to make them proud um, for them to watch me play. And uh, also for me personally, um, to just, yeah, like you said, put on a jersey, go out there and represent. And um, that's what I'm looking to do more in the future as well. Yeah, we've been in camp a couple of days now. How would you say the training sessions have been getting to know the other members of the squad and, you know, the staff as well? Yeah, for me personally, um, getting to know everyone's really important to, um, you know, bond with them. I, I'm really big on that. I feel like a winning team is a team that's together. Um, so, yeah, just getting to know all the players and all the staff has been great. And then on the pitch, we've been working hard, um, working on both sides of uh, both sides of football, defending, attacking. Um, and, yeah, we've... Um, we're doing really well. The manager's really, really clear on what he wants. And um, yeah, as long as we stick to the plan and stick together, we'll be good. Yeah, and for those individuals that don't know a lot about you, you can touch a little bit about, you know, where you can play on the field because you're quite a versatile player. Yeah, so um, last season, uh, yeah, I played most positions, to be fair. I played anywhere on the back four and then being able to step into midfield and, and do a job there. So I don't mind where I play, I just like being on the pitch and yeah, I, I can't wait to represent Jamaica. Yeah, and when you bear in mind the, the exciting summer ahead, how how thrilled are you to be part of this sort of experience? Yeah, it's, it is a great experience and um, yeah, it's a very, I'm really honoured to, to be able to do that. Um, so yeah, we're, we're really looking forward to it. Um, we've got a really good squad. Um, we're just going to keep building and building, getting better every day and um, take that over to the States. Yeah, and of course, we remember, especially in the academies, we remember seeing you at Manchester City, where you won the Premier League North title with them. You also captained the team in the FA Youth Cup. How key were they in your development as a professional? Yeah, being at, I think being at Man City was, um, was really big for me. I was uh, really lucky to be there and spend a lot of time there and learn a lot of things, um, not just on the pitch, but off the pitch as well. So I, I had a great time there. I've developed a lot and... Um, yeah, like I said, this is the player I am today and I'm just excited to, to get out there and show what I can do. Yeah, and of course now being at Swansea, you know, how have they been in terms of, you know, giving you the minutes that you need to, of course, be in a, a situation where you're able to represent your country? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm really happy with the season I had and thank you to the to the manager and the staff there um, for giving me the minutes that I do need and to, to show the staff here that I'm capable of playing. So, um, yeah, just, just really proud to be here. All right, Joel, all the best in the upcoming games. All right, thank you, man. Good stuff. Good stuff.